Today gonna be a very, 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 very special video. I'm gonna need y'all to go to the pinned up comment section and especially go to my Facebook, but also go to my Instagram and my TikTok and comment as well. It's going viral. I woke up and I thought about something amazing this morning and I put it on Facebook. Y'all read the title. Check out what I put on Facebook. And within 11 minutes, these are just a few of the comments it's going to be viral by the time y'all see this video. So y'all come follow me on my platforms and y'all let them know how global dripping rolling. So go to Facebook, go comment, go follow me, go to all my socials on Instagram. It's all the same at the real tab flames. Y'all just look at the proof. <laughs> To me, the math won't really matter. So I'm like, why would a man in a healthy, good relationship with a beautiful woman that's loyal cheat on her with ugly ass, monkey looking, ape looking, gorilla looking, stinking ass bitches? Make it make sense. Guy have a beautiful black woman go cheat on with a crackhead looking white woman. Have a beautiful Hispanic go cheat on her with an ugly ass Puerto Rican, have a pretty ass Latino go cheat on her with a uh, ugly ass black girl, have a pretty ass white woman go cheat on her with an ugly ass Asian. It just don't make sense and it constantly continue. So I asked Facebook and that's why I said y'all go to my Facebook especially, but also my Instagram and come in. Also my TikTok and come in. I want y'all to show them the power of global dripping. I got all my friends from my city coming and they're going viral. I want y'all to come and say, I'm from Global Dripping. State yourself and state your opinion, especially on Facebook. So now it's making a little bit better sense to me. And remember, I posted this in 11 minutes. It got 20 some shares and 20 some comments. So I'm just going off the ones that stood out. One girl said, because I guess wifey, the pretty girl pussy ain't good enough. That really could be a good option. One other girl said because it's toxic and the ugly girl bringing peace. Another girl said beauty is in the eye of the beholder. All of those are correct. Um, it's a guy named Averb. He used to be a battle rapper, still is. He said the most really thing that I can uh, make an excuse for me. Does it make it right? Nah, but does it make it true? Fuck yeah. Um, a guy don't want to, I don't care how pretty she is, a guy don't want to fuck his girlfriend three times a day, the same girl. But he'll be hyped as fuck to fuck three girls that day. I get what y'all saying, but you get what I'm saying. He could bust three nuts off his girl, his girl that day, but he wouldn't want to do that. But if he had three different girls, he would be excited. That's just how men wired. They just want some different. Instead of having that dime piece that he in love with, that's his dream girl, instead of fuck her three times, he would rather fuck her, an ugly bitch, and another ugly bitch before he keep fucking her. That's just how me and wire. It don't make sense. Um, another girl commented, uh, let me see, hold on, y'all. Let me check, because it's going crazy right now. Um, another girl commented, uh, I post a few on the screen, but they keep coming in. Um, uh, because the girl at home is crazy and he trying to find peace. We already spoke on that. Um, oh, because the girl at home is a broke bitch and on food stamps and he trying to get away out of there. All right, cause some pretty bitches ain't what they need to be and ugly bitches just might be better quality, just to guess. Now y'all, that all makes sense. And like I told y'all, this shit been up a couple of minutes and it went viral. So y'all come to my Facebook, as y'all seen on the screen, and y'all go ahead and come in and show them the power of global dripping. Y'all follow me on my TikTok, follow me on my Instagram, and follow me on my Facebook. Y'all come in and on my last post, y'all like all my pictures, we finna turn it up. 
like, comment, subscribe, but let me break down my summary. Let me tell you how I feel about it. Let me tell you the way I'm 100% sure that I'm accurate because I'm an expert at this shit. Let me tell you why guys do that for real. They do it for every reason why them girls just name. But I'm going to tell you the real reason why they do it. Men. I'm sorry to expose you guys. Men need validation just like women. I don't care how bad a woman is. If he only had one. And she treat him high. Or she treat him like a king of terrible. He feel like. One is too close to done. One too close to none. So guys have a scarcity mindset. So y'all ladies don't understand. These ugly bitches are actually saving y'all. Not saying they're making it right. Y'all don't feel like fucking. Y'all want to go on y'all trips. Y'all want to do y'all thing. Y'all want to have fun. You want to enjoy yourself, right? Okay, y'all want to do all of that. Well, that's when he got that ugly ass side bitch over there. Um... That's why you don't got to suck his dick as much because she doing it. That's why you ain't got to fuck him as much because she doing it. That's why you don't got to run his errands. She doing it. So she really a blessing in disguise. But this is my only thing. I done had so many bad bitches crying to me that if they would have caught their man cheating with a girl that was badder, that would make sense. But it would hurt them worse to see somebody badder. But it make girls feel like this when they catch you cheating with a girl that's not on their level. They be like, oh, that nigga. It still hurt. But if they see a girl that's just as better, or, I mean better or just as good, it's going to kill them. So, guys, I, I see it like this. And glory be to God for waking me up this morning. And all thanks go to the God, Jesus, the Holy Spirit. But I'm just going to tell you like this, like my daddy tell me. If you're going to be a sinner, be a sinner. Don't go to hell for just smoking weed. Don't go to hell for just selling weed. Man, you better go to hell for killing. If you're going to go to hell, bust it wide open. If you're going to go to hell, so if you're going to cheat, guys, cheat wide open. Don't cheat with the ugly bitch around the corner that suck dick for coke. Don't cheat for all of that. Don't cheat. And drugs got a lot to do with people cheating, I guarantee you. And, 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 and if you're going to cheat, man, upgrade. Cheat with the baddest bitches in the world or just stay with your girl. Tell her what you want. That's the problem. Y'all guys don't want to tell her what you want, what you need. You'll be surprised what a woman will agree to if you just tell her. But you guys rather run behind her back, do stupid shit. Now, this is one of the realest videos I ever made. Y'all really, 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 really better run this up. Y'all better share this. Go to every one of my platforms. It's pinned up in my comment section. Go to every one of my platforms today and run it up. And everybody that ain't subscribed, go subscribe and hit that bell notification. I love each and every one of y'all. If you want to book a one-on-one -on -one between me and you, my personal number, $100 FaceTime call. If you got uh, problems with your bitch, your nigga, whatever, I'll tell you straight up. But I don't sugarcoat nothing because I'm on that story shit. But that said, y'all have a blessed day. And y'all let me know in this comment section and on my TikTok, my Instagram, my Facebook. And especially here, let me know why do men cheat. Because when women cheat, they usually try to upgrade. The guy that they cheat with usually got a better car, better house, a better attitude, more money in his bank. Most of the time. Most of the time. But guys don't care. They would downgrade like a motherfucker for a nut. A woman only upgrade mostly for a nut if she got sense. But with that said, y'all let me know what y'all think. I need y'all help. I holler. It's global dripping. And somebody told me, said, man, you so lit in the United States. Nah, I'm lit everywhere. This is global dripping, not local dripping. Don't disrespect me, fool.